all of this work I'm about to do here needs to disappear at the end. So it will be painted over and it will be gone at the end of the exhibition. When Wendy first came up with her concept to trace her family roots going back to the Ukraine, she came to the museum with a proposal and showed it to me and I think I immediately fell in love with it. Hi, Wendy Sharp. Thank you. I'm in the temporary exhibition space of Sydney Jewish Museum and I'm about to paint on all of these walls, I've started to plot them out in chalk, uh, a mural that is inspired by a trip I made in 2019 with my cousin Ruth. We went first of all around the East End and around London and then we went to the Ukraine. And the plan came from some of these folding books that I actually made when I was in the Ukraine. And I'm not just drawing where I went and what I saw, I'm also trying to show something about how I felt. Uh, which is what I want this mural to be. For Wendy, it's not just the art, it's not just the mural. It's the telling and the processing and the working through and the spilling out of everything that she has inside of her about tracing her family roots and painting her on the walls in such a way that it's open enough for a visitor to interpret elements of it for themselves. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. <laughs> we can't. No, we uh, Lovely can't. to meet you. Lovely to meet you I'm, too. I'm so excited. What motivated yeah. you, what inspired you rather to want to do this? When I was started to do this looking into family history, I found an amazing document written by one of my relatives where he writes a very short paragraph about every member of the family, describing what they were like and various things that happened in their life. I never met Bessie, my grandmother. She died in the 1950s when she was, she was only 50, before I was born in England. And when he talks about Bessie, um, he says, you know, how terrible it was that her husband died and da 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 da. And then he writes, and she used to sing this song. Where is the street, where is the house? Longing for a place which is gone and then realising that when you reach that in your dreams, it no longer exists. It is the stories of our people. It's the stories of the Jewish people as they moved through time and history from place to place where they're not wanted or where they have to escape pogroms or they have to go through wars. Kamenets Podolsky, which I'm painting now, in 1941, over three days, 23,000 Jews were killed. And by its very nature, this mural is ephemeral. And like that world she's painting, it's going to disappear. We felt like we were looking, well, we are looking for the past that's gone anyway, but we also felt like we ourselves were almost ghost walking through it. So not only is the mural a first for us, but having an artist actually producing her art in the space as an artist in residence is the first for our museum. Finished. Finished.